Tanner on my face. My latest obsession lately is the one carb waffle, which is a protein waffle. Just protein powder, egg, baking powder. Stick it in the waffle make it, and you're done. My toppings are awesome. So I'm gonna be using select protein cookies and cream. Just the flavor that I have left that I need to get rid of. But my favorite is chocolate peanut butter from them. Because it tastes literally like peanut butter if you put it in your oatmeal. And then amazing blondie, just like a sweet thing. I'm just gonna weigh out my serving. I think I'm having like two servings today just because I'm not gonna be able to eat until way later. I think the most annoying thing is putting everything back because I forget and then I have like 25 things. I'm just gonna grab that egg. If you guys let me do a what's in my fridge, I think that'd actually be really exciting just because I have a lot of cool food. Do you think I could do this one-handed? I don't even think I can do this one-handed. But I know my egg skills and they suck. If you have the macros to put in a little bit of like pancake mix, by all means do that. But today, I do not. What am I doing? I swear I don't look like that. But my favorite proteins are Select Protein and Quest. Yeah, that's life. Hello there. This is the most essential thing to making protein shit. If you don't have baking powder, your things are gonna suck. I'm just being straight up. So I stirred that shit. Now I'm gonna put the baking powder because it kind of, oh, okay. Oh, I need a little more. Oh, okay. She got me this one from Walmart, I believe, for like 15 bucks. So it's really not that much of an investment, but I use it literally all the time. And I like to use pan butter spray because it makes it all like buttery waffles, you know. The batter can't be too thin because if it's too thin, it's just not going to like bake. Well, spray that thing all butter, butter. Oh, no, it looks perfect. Because the batter is thick, fill it up like to like here and then slam it. And then it lets it all like come to life. for the toppings because I'm the best at the toppings. Let's make some coffee, yo. We need that motherfucker on strong. More water. I hate when that happens. Let's try that again. Do I even adult? I don't think so. And then I just add almond milk and then sweetener. I'm gonna be using spray butter first. But today I'm doing Cool Whip, a little bit of peanut butter bites and melted, enlightened ice cream. Probably talking to yourself. No. <laughs> Ooh, caramel cookie crunch is really good. Yeah, we're gonna do that one. Spray butter. Sugar-free syrup. Favorite ice cream at the moment is enlightened ice cream and it's only 100 calories per serving and it tastes great. So the trick with this is you microwave it for like 30 seconds to make it really liquidy and then you drizzle it over and it's like icing sauce. It's really, really good. So the trick is if your pancakes kind of suck or if you just want more flavor. Cool Whip tastes really, really nice. This is door bread. I don't know why people make fun of me for it, but it's like two dollars cheaper, so. Okay, so the sides are melted. But that's how you can like save ice cream and you don't necessarily put scoops of it on there. Oh my gosh, it looks beautiful. <laughs> Oops, and there you have it. I'll show you guys the macros on the screen for this. There you go. Boy, boy.